Hi guys. Um, one of my previous videos about that um, Parkside circular saw. Uh, we changed the brushes, but unfortunately, within uh, within a, a week of working steadily working, it, it just chew chew off uh, the brushes and it's parking again like crazy. Now <clears throat> I dismantled the machine. Um, those those brushes which you can see on the video which I add on the on the in the description. So those those have been replaced, but uh, they more or less they more or less chewed off. So uh, it's a bit difficult to take them out, but I do that later. And um, now what I'm trying to do, this is the collector, and what I'm trying to do, it looks a bit it looks a bit eaten. So I'm I'm, I'm I will will be trying to to file the whole thing down. Obviously, I've got a little problem. How am I gonna turn it? Uh, I don't have a, I don't have a lathe, so I have to I have to use tools what I have. And um, my girlfriend's gonna help me. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna put a drill. We're gonna put a drill in here, and then we we we, we will try to turn this whole thing. And then hopefully with a, with a file, I can do uh, I can I can take off uh, a little bit of the, uh, that collector here. It's plenty of uh, plenty of copper on it, but as you can see it's uh, it's kind of it's kind of eaten so this 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 is what i think causes the causes the sparks so um this is all all a little overheated because of all the sparking going on from the from the brushes and my problem is also that i can't replace the brushes every every couple of weeks i mean uh, i appreciate maybe those brushes uh, are a bit dodgy then from amazon uh, having said that, the original brushes lasted for for uh, ten years, or I don't know when I bought. I, I think I bought it in 2005. This machine, so basically 13 years old. So um, my, my girlfriend's gonna help me, and uh, we're gonna try to uh, try to do this. Uh, I don't know how the filming gonna come come out. Uh, possibly it's gonna be crap because uh, filming and holding the camera in one hand. But I will try my very best. I might be able to set up the camera for you to to see what we're actually doing. Right. Okay, that that should be alright. So this is like a, a file, and now my girlfriend puts the drill in here and just 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 pull it, please. That's it. The, 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 continuously. No. Pull, 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 pull. Right. Okay. Sorry, sorry. It's not working. It's not working. It's not working. Unfortunately. Uh, because we can't somehow fix the drill properly on it. Um, this is this is a pain in the neck, right? Let's let's. Start. No, um, pain in the neck. I have to. I have to use a different drill. So um, I have to use a different drill. So maybe we can try it with that one. Now I've, I found a solution. Now I take this file, and obviously normally you have to use a lathe to take off all this. But I'm hoping. I'm hoping I can do that with this file. So we're gonna. We're gonna uh, pull the drill and let's do this. Come on. Okay, that looks that looks definitely that looks definitely much better. There's a crack or something. I'm going to I'm going to give it a bit more to maybe get rid of that go, go, uh, that crack. Go. Right now this. This collector, guys, is now almost like new. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna still go a bit more. We're gonna we're gonna go a bit further. Um, we're gonna go a bit further, 
and then if I would have some some very uh, very fine uh, sa sandpaper, that would be lovely, which I don't, but it's okay. Uh, go. Okay, I almost take my head off. Go. Right. Okay. Now, uh, basically perfect. This is this is what I wanted from the very beginning, but I didn't know how to how it comes out. But now it came out. So um, this was the this was the solution we found before. Just uh, put put a drill in here. Yeah. And then just uh, then just whack it that way. But as you can, as you could see, live on camera, everything happens. So uh, this is lovely because this this is what I wanted before, and uh, now now it happens. So uh, um, all fine. I've got the setup now. This is what I wanted originally. I just didn't know how to get that uh, that roto out of that uh, out of that case. But this is my this is my setup, and uh, the the drill is gonna is gonna play the the, the motor obviously for the for the lay lathe, and then I will I will use more more work with the um, with the um, with the file. So uh, let's do this. Here's the focus, yeah. Right now, this rotor. Uh, looks like new more or less what we're gonna do since I don't have any any fine sandpaper my girlfriend's gonna bring me some uh, some um, uh, metal wall or something she's using for for the for, for cleaning the dishes and we're gonna we're gonna do that uh, to to uh, make it a little bit fine and then it should be fine compare compare the way it looked like that should be that should be taken care of business tour is now shining as you can clearly see it's absolutely beautiful and um, this is the this is basically the setup uh, a drill on my lap and I used uh, some files and to finish it off I use that uh, stuff it's, it's completely dry from the kitchen and it's now really really nice um, blow it blow it blow it a lot uh, blow with with air just to to uh, to make sure there are no uh, no shorts between the between the the copper uh, lamels. So now let me put on together the machine and uh, let's see what happens. I am telling you it was sparking, it was sparking like crazy um, with the new brushes and I have no idea why. So uh, I hope uh, I hope it's uh, it's uh, it's gonna be okay now um, if not I just carry on investigating um, this machine is uh, 13 years old it's not worth much but I, I just you know I like to do it so stay tuned now here are the brushes and uh, if you see my video which is in the description you will see uh, they have been brand new like a couple of weeks ago maybe three weeks ago and uh, they're more or less they're more or less already already uh, used up but um, I'm not gonna buy any new ones until until the that scenario is not fixed but uh, it should be all right let's see what happens um, and if uh, if it works then I'm gonna get a couple of new brushes and be back in business just are back all looks uh, hunky-dory now I'm gonna pop in uh, pop on pop on the cover, cover. Uh, you have to put back the cover make sure you don't test it because look this these brushes are a bit wobbly so make sure the cover is back which pushes pushes down those brushes and then we're gonna fire up that gear let's see what happens